Hey everyone, Andrew from Wild Edge. I just want to go through the advantages and disadvantages of using one rope or two ropes as you're climbing, ascending the tree and descending. Everyone thinks that you need two ropes. You have to have a lines and line and a tether. They are basically both the same thing, whether you're under a Prusik, Blake's hitch, distal hitch, or any kind of Kong duck or any ascender. Um, what I do personally, a lot of times, I keep things super simple. I don't like dump pouches that are swaying against my hips and catching on shit when I'm walking into the woods. I like to have my rope, my one rope, sometimes two, in my cargo pocket. When I get to the tree, say I'm just using one rope. I'll take that rope out, either carabiner on one side through the lines of loop, or I'll just girth hitch it, which is what's nice about the sewn eye on the O-plux. And as I'm climbing the tree, obviously using my lines in line. So as I'm climbing, say I come to a limb and I have to detach my lines in line. That's the advantage of having two ropes. You would then take your other rope out of your pouch, your pocket, whatever it is, attach it to your lines in line, go around the tree. To me, that just takes a little bit too much time, a little too much effort. So what I'll do, is I always have a carabiner on my hip or on my back. On my back is usually where my bow is hanging from. So I'll reach down, grab a carabiner off my hip. And as I'm climbing, I'll usually have my bridge just to open just a little bit. So it's right there. Clip the carabiner to the bridge, clip it to the step. So I'm attached to the tree. still attach go around the limb reattach my lines and loop unclip from the step so I'm always attached to the tree the whole point of being safe is always be attached to the tree and for those guys using naders and suaders or any kind of aider system the advantage to an adjustable bridge is that you can always say your next step is up here you can always lengthen it as much as it'll go and go and clip to your step. No matter where your step is, you can clip to it as long as it's from your waist up and then detach your lines and line. Same thing goes when I get to my climbing height, I'll put another step right here at my waist and that step not only is my anchor, but it turns into my hand hold, it turns into my, my gear holder, backpack holder, bow holder, everything. I'll slide that step right to the side of the tree. I'll take my carabiner, hook to my bridge, hook to my step, I'm now secured with two points of contact. Undo my lines and line, which then becomes my tether. I'm going to tether around the tree. There's a beauty about the Kong duck. Super easy to adjust. Clip right to my bridge, take some slack out. Unhook from the step, and I'm ready to hunt.